what's up? Welcome to another episode of Walk With Me from Aspie Attitude. My name is David, I'm from Melbourne, Australia. I have autism, speech difficulty, have speaking syndrome, and that's why I call myself an Aspie. At this time round, I'm in the eastern part of Melbourne, about to go on a bushwalk through Warrandyte State Park, and I'm gonna start my journey at Black Flat, and I'll be walking my way to Chupping Creek Reserve. So along the way, I'm gonna show you this one famous river. So I'm not gonna sit around and waste time talking. So I'm just gonna get on my adventure. Yeah, and just please come with me as we explore Wyandotte State Park from Aspie with Attitude. So, how you find this walk so far from Aspie with Attitudes, walk with me in Warrandyte State Park. Well, so far, there was this black flat, but I'm not gonna explore the whole park since I didn't think there's this much to see, apart from this time-lapse shot that you're just watching just then. I'm just gonna continue on my walk to Jumping Creek, and I've still yet gonna show you this famous river that I keep telling you about. If you wanna see this, yeah, please come with me, and let's just keep Exploring from Aspie with Attitude. Walk with me, please.
Something that I actually wanted to show you on this walk is that famous river that I told you about earlier. And the name of this famous river is called the Yarra River. And what's so special about this river is, if you follow the current and you film down there, that goes right through the whole entire city of Melbourne till it gets it to a big bay called Port Phillip Bay. So right now, this is all bush. And just looking at a river here, I have no intentions to go for a swim in that river. You can see in the rapids how strong the current is. And if you follow the current, it can easily drag you under. You can even see how dark and murky this water. So I have no idea what's in the bottom of the water. That's how dangerous these rivers can get. So like, the way I look at this river there is like, if I could travel 500 years back in time from being in the middle of Melbourne, just say where Swanson Street Bridge is and near Flinders Street Station, imagine another 500 years in the future, there'll be Flinders Street Station and across there will be the Swanson Bridge and the Arts Entertainment Centre and South Bank being up there. Well, this is going 500 years in the past before the British Empire colonised Australia. So, like, I want to continue on with the walk with Walk With Me from Aspie With Attitude.
Well, I finally just reached my destination, which is Jumping Creek, and it just happens that I'm doing this in this little picnic shelter, since there's a lot of canoeing and kayaking groups all happening around this point. So uh, it's just a bit of a long walk, enough just to sort of help me lose weight a bit. Since then, the last month, throughout February 2021, I've already lost three kilos. So anyway, I'm just gonna see what I can do to continue on this Walk With Me adventure from Aspie With Attitude. So now, here I am. This is the actual Jumping Creek Reserve. So like, I just came over here where it's just a bit more quieter where I can just actually tell you about the surroundings here, which I'm actually standing next to the Yarra River. So I did show you earlier about the rapids. So just in that direction around the bend, there's obviously a scout group getting ready to go canoeing in this river. So I thought I want to quickly make this video just to tell you about this walk. And I'll come closer to the camera. And I just want to show you something here. So just in case the kids are going to come along and canoe around here. So oh yeah, you can just see how beautiful it is. We're all talking about going for a swim here. The water might look very inviting and very tempting. So this time around, I'm not even tempted to go in. And I can just see there's plenty of footprints down there. But once I get in the middle of a river, I have no idea how deep the river is. I don't know what's under the river, but I know there's currents and snags. So since I'm all by myself, it's just too dangerous to go swimming all by yourself in rivers like this, which means more people actually drown that river than anywhere else in Victoria, apparently so. So it's just always just common sense. So anyway, like, up there it's this car park, which means I'm not going to be filming car parks. So there was a viewing platform, like, I couldn't film on the viewing platform due to the amount of noise from all these kids from the scouts getting ready to go canoeing. So, like, I could just see what's up that track then. So anyway, this is just how far it's all going to go, like, I can see there's a bit of a wombat hole here, but I just don't want to go any further, but I think I'm just getting into a rugged bushland here. I want to admire the look of the Yarra River, yeah, it's just so beautiful, and I can just see it's just only about an ankle deep, yeah, once you get in there, that's where things may get very dangerous, because like, you always swim with friends, but I can never get my friend Matt, the guy who makes a regular appearance on Aspie Attitude due to a few snakes. So like, I'm just hoping I don't see any snakes around. Yeah, cause like, yeah, my friend Matt doesn't like going through dense bushland whatsoever. So no, I just thought this is just Nice to actually be taking this in for my video called Walk With Me. Now, here's finally the place I was trying to get to, which is the actual viewing platform of the Jumping Creek Reserve, just overlooking at a river down now. Now that the kids on their canoes have now moved on downstream, well, it's just finally gave me an opportunity just to sort of observe what's actually pretty much from your platform. So on the other side of the river here, like I've just got this real interesting 
cliff face. So I don't think not many people would ever be interested, but I just wouldn't mind actually having a closer look at it just to get it for my video. And I can always zoom out and get you to tell down there this is Silvio River. And also you got weeds over there. So there's more reeds. So oh yeah, yeah, this is cool. And obviously a private house on top of a hill here. Anyway, that's a launching place for all canoeists and all kayakers. Just go down to main town, which is actually all down there. And also in that direction is towards the city. And the other way is towards another town called Warburton. So which I won't be going to today. Yeah, so how cool is that? Like I just absolutely love the scenery around here. Hmm. Yeah, it's just got a bit of a dry landscape. But it's just cool just to get it all in before one day. There's going to be a major bushfire that's going to burn all this out. Maybe one day in the future. Let's hope not. I can show you what's down this track. There's a hidden bush track right here. And if you go down this track, it's going to take you straight to the church. And however it is though, yeah, please come along with me down this track. And we're going to look at that church. This is an absolute bonus for this edition of Walk With Me. And what I actually found in this bush is actually a church. Like I told you so, that there was actually like a church inside this bit of bush or inside this forest. So uh, that looks cool. The idea this is, it probably used to be a scout camp that's been built by the Australian Scout Association, this outdoor church. Well, it's highly expected though. Like, this is out in the wilderness. Oh yes, just sort of having a look around and also playing for fidget spinner on the altar too. So anyway, time to walk down the aisle. out from the bush now and I think it's time to come with me back to picnic ground back to Jumping Creek Reserve for me to sign off from Aspie of Attitude and I just hope you enjoyed this bonus walk and come along let's get back to picnic ground shall we and now this is where I finish off this video content from Aspie of Attitude walk with me after going for a walk from Black Flat all the way to Jumping Creek Reserve which is where I'm going to finish off this video. So like if you really enjoyed this video that I had made for Walk With Me, please why not subscribe to my YouTube channel just to deepen the support. And if you'd like to see more videos like this, you can always click the notification bell to keep up to date with Aspie Attitude. And also, don't forget to like and share this video content with your friends, with your family, with your autism community and those who actually have any interest in going around Warrandyte. And also, don't forget that I got a link down below in the description if you want to see a playlist for every Walk With Me videos that I had made since September 2019. And just the way I want to pull this one off as I finish off this video content, 
It's with the fidget spin nose trick. I'd like to say, thanks for watching. Thanks for listening to Aspie Attitudes. Peace and respect, and see you next time.